Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Tom Spark and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about what are the most anonymous or privacy friendly VPNs out there. These are the VPNs that are the best at respecting your privacy and anonymity and providing the best product for those things. This is going to be a list for 2022. We're going to be looking at several key things to analyze and compare which VPNs have the best um, privacy and anonymity offered. But wait, Tom, why should we listen to you? You're just some random guy on the internet, right? Wrong. I'm not just some random guy. I'm the guy who created the first VPN tier list. Now, I've pretty much created every single VPN out there, and this is something no one else has ever done. I've been doing this for around five years now, and I've probably spent thousands of hours of reviewing VPNs. And that means these reviews are the most accurate on the internet, bar none. So some of the things we're going to be looking for, guys, is which VPNs can offer these things perfectly. They don't have any compromise pretty much in any area. And those things that we're looking for are two-factor authentication support. VPNs should support two-factor authentication on their website account page, so that way you can protect your account and make sure no one else is using it. You'd be surprised how many VPNs out there, even some big names, don't support 2FA with a code-based authenticator app on your phone. I'm not talking about something like ExpressVPN, which is uses email two-factor authentication. I'm talking about having an authenticator app on your phone and being able to make sure it's protected um, on your account with a VPN. Secondly, we're going to be looking for VPNs that support open source analytics. You don't really want to use a VPN that uses Google Analytics or other privacy unfriendly analytic platforms. Even if they um, say they're not collecting information, usually they are collecting anonymous information or metadata to improve their services. At the end of the day, maybe this isn't the most evil thing in the world. But if you're looking for the most private and anonymous VPN provider, you're going to be wanting to use a VPN provider that uses open source, privacy friendly analytics on their website that's not sending it to Google or Facebook. Additionally, you don't want a VPN that has cookies on their website that's tracking you across different websites. And you'd be surprised how many VPNs out there actually do have tons of cookies on their website. Next up, we don't want to see application trackers either on mobile platforms. We don't want to see um, things that are tracking you on mobile like Google Analytics and other forms of trackers. You can see most VPNs out there cannot pass this either. Android has a lot of trackers on it. Now again, it's similar to website trackers. They might not be super nefarious and in effort to pr um, provide support for their application and improve it and stuff like that. Um, but still, if a VPN can do without these trackers, um, it's just simply more private and anonymous than the other ones that do it with the trackers. Next up, we're going to be looking at logs collected. We don't want VPNs that do collect logs. Um, at the end of the day, um, there are a lot of VPNs that collect logs, especially free VPNs. And some of the more popular VPNs do collect minor forms of logs. But in this video, we're looking only at VPNs that don't collect any logs. And there have been no history of them collecting logs either. So, um, we also don't want to see that. We don't want to see data leaks either. And it's kind of similar to logs. Has a company given up logs? Or has a company also um, had some kind of data leak, data breach? Have they mismanaged servers? Have their um, private keys been leaked or something like that? Have they um, forgot to encrypt some servers in the past? We can't include VPNs like that because they need a perfect track record, in my opinion. Now, some people might trust VPNs that have had... Um, imperfect track records but in this video we're only looking at the perfect vpns so there you go lastly we do not want to see company acquisition or change of hand in terms of the company i believe if a company sells out or transfers ownership at the end of the day you can't always be sure of where the company's headed if they're going to maintain the same level of privacy as they have in the past because it is in new ownership Whenever a company changes ownership, things inevitably change and privacy and anonymity of you could be at concern. So guys, with those things in mind, which VPNs can actually succeed in each area and do all of these things? Well, not many, but the ones that do are excellent. So guys, first up on the list is TorGuard VPN. Now TorGuard VPN is the top rated VPN on the channel. Not only because it excels in that privacy section, it pretty much nails every fundamental thing we're looking for. It's got 2FA, has no logs, it's owned by the same company. If you look at the trackers on it, has zero trackers on the website, zero trackers on Android, and that's very, very impressive. 
They even offer complimentary privacy services, which isn't something I mentioned in this video about the qualifications needed, but it's cool if you do want private email because they have a bundle that gives you email plus VPN for around $60 a year or cheaper long term. So it gives you even more privacy outside of VPN, which is something none of the other VPNs actually really offer too much. There really isn't that many other VPNs that offer such an affordable um, email plus VPN bundle than TorGuard does. So that's pretty cool. It's definitely one of the best VPNs on the channel. And honestly, since it's so highly rated, it is the one I go to the most to use day to day. It's my day to day VPN. It's consistent. It works well. It's also extremely affordable, um, which is why I use it as a daily driver on both phone and PC. Um, it's definitely one I always have installed on my computer. So that's probably why it's my number one recommendation here on the channel. Um, that affordability factor also gives it that sweet spot combined with the perfect privacy. Um, if you use my code TomSpark22, or if you click on the link on VPNTerials.com or in the description down below, you can get amazing deals on TorGuard. It's pretty much cheaper than every other VPN out there. And that's another reason. If you aren't sacrificing price or privacy, in my opinion, it's a win. So check that one out. Next up, we're going to be talking about Hi.me. And now this is one I've really liked lately. And it's an excellent VPN. It fulfills every single thing we're looking for. It's got 2FA. It, it's never changed hand. Perfect privacy policy. Perfect um, anonymity and privacy for a VPN. It's just a simply excellent VPN. It also has a couple other bonuses. Like it was one of the first VPNs, I believe, to be publicly audited. That's not really a qualification here in this system. But it is a bonus because a lot of VPNs have had leaks and stuff. Then they get publicly audited and say, hey, you could trust us now, right? When in fact, that's not what Hide.me has done. They got one of the first VPNs to be publicly audited and they've never had any leaks either. So it's just simply quite put an excellent VPN. Just like TorGuard, it's actually one of the VPNs I always have installed on my apps as well. Um, as you can see here, it's a pretty cool application. Tons of cool, innovative features and great security and privacy in the application as well as just as a company itself. Um, so just like TorGuard, it's something I always keep installed. And it's definitely one of my top VPN recommendations here on the channel. So guys, I hope you like this video on the most private and anonymous VPNs going into 2022. These are the ones that I think are the best and I've explained why. I hope you agree with that. If not, let me know in the comments down below. I'll see you in the next video very soon.